All right, greetings and salutations. My name is Comic Fire, and welcome back for more. The world ends with you. Last time we finished up day three and uh, fought a pretty rough boss. Days are getting harder, so let's keep going on with the fourth day. Let's see if we can't take it easier today, huh? Oh no, we're uh, starting out with uh, armed combat. <laughs> I love it. I love that this is what they're doing in their spare time. I mean, Joshua, you've been kind of rammed up my ass this whole time. I wouldn't really have the time to train away from you. I mean, I feel like Joshua's got a point here. I didn't hear a ringtone, you're just gonna sit there and pretend I'm not here. God, there's still this many players in the game. How many players start out on a game? I mean, it's still working out, though. Oh, shit. They don't even know. No, nah, I mean, he's doing his job. He can't be all that bad. Ooh. But, so they're dead, is what we're getting at. Jesus. That is what it is. Damn. We're gonna have to fight this guy, huh? Yeah, kind of like, uh, One for All. Damn it, I hate cliffhangers like that. Huh. Mr. That is busty, Jesus. You don't just insult a man's cafe to his face. Nope, that was fast. I'm curious. <sighs> Don't give me some kind of half answer, I know it's coming. <laughs> oh, oh, that is definitely not a half answer. You take it to a nice dinner and touch his penis? Well, yeah, but we got Shiki waiting for us now. <laughs> Why'd you ask the question, asshole? Oh, yeah, to try to shake me, huh? Huh. And we're getting kind of late into the week, we might be able to get some answers out of that. Anyway, now we can go. So before we do, we've got a couple extra things we can do. Reaper, stop harassing the young lady and give me something to do. Oh, make it ten, because I'm really hungry. Anyway, we just gotta do what the nice man says, so, uh... I was kinda hoping I could chain... Oh god, I couldn't even chain more than that. Anyway, I'll, I'll cut out when we're done with 10. 
Okay, and we're back. We've taken out 10 noise. Uh, lovely beam evolved into sexy beam, which is quite a sight stronger. And yet, yeah, takes about the same time to reload, is more powerful, and is a little wider to boot. I like it. What do you got for me, big boy? Plus, I set it to hard, lowered the uh, my HP, so I got a lot of money and I got a lot of pins. We get some, uh, get some pretty ribbon. Anyway, uh, we don't need to go there, but hey, we got a pretty ribbon out of it, so we can always use that for later. So let's go over to the Center Street entrance real quick. Because as always, there's more things to do. What do you need, bucko? One sexy plus, huh? I could have swore we had a sexy plus. Oh, wow. <laughs> I was prepared to just blow past this guy, but apparently I don't. I have sexy D? Anyway, what's noise number 59 again? Let's take a look-see. Why do we never seem to know which one they are? Anyway, uh, set the difficulty to easy, lower our thing way down to eight, because if we're on easy, it doesn't really matter. Uh, let's sample some of the local cuisine. Because I don't remember which one has the one we need. I don't think it's this one. But it's easy mode, so, uh, not too worried, even. There we go. These Easter Ravens are what we need. It's immediate murder. It's pretty good. Let's hope I got what I needed right off the bat. Yeah, two sexy pluses. Not bad. Not bad at all. So let's get our shit back to normal, then. So putting on easy, but the big numbers makes me feel good. Yeah, yeah, we got them. Anyway, moving on. Though I think there's something I want here at AMX. We have all these, huh? Thank you. Maybe what I want in a future day. In the future! Well, I didn't fight any four chains, and even so, I don't think it would count for that one, so let's just knock these ones out. With high HP. Though I suppose I should have taken the time to at least lower my HP a bit, but... Eh, fuck it. We're doing pretty good on money as is. I still love this pin, it's so fun. Something about just focusing light and holding it down. They get kind of spark man drilled a bit. It's it's just fun. They can't fight back. I feel like a bully. It's every empowerment fantasy I've ever had growing up as a kid. I'm just kidding, but... It is nice to just kind of go through certain fights as an unstoppable death god. Games don't always need to be difficult. Sometimes you just want to hit things really hard. It's the whole reason I like, uh... Fire Emblem, uh, Fate's Birthright. I don't always want to think too hard about what I'm doing. It was just fun going through that game as an unstoppable death god. Games are just supposed to be fun. If anyone goes through uh, only going up slashes, uh, they're not to be trusted. And a lot of people do side slashes with the shockwave pins from all the stuff I've seen on YouTube, and I'm like, I don't know how you do it. Here, I'll try it on this guy. I mean, yeah, but just slashing down just feels like it flows a lot easier on the hand. You're leveling up so much in this day. Which is good, because we're kind of going to need all the HP we can get uh, for a uh, future boss. 
Or maybe you won't, but I certainly like to be uh, better prepared for it because he's kind of a drag. Him has a lot of HP. Oh, hey, guy. Nah, let's go for it. What do we got here? I like that one. It's a little, uh, little on the nose, but... He certainly is. Maybe what we really needed all along was just art. How did we forget this guy? He's unique among the Reapers. Uh, but sure, what do you need, buddy? Oh, God damn it. I suppose that was on me, huh? I mean, it is what it is. Uh, but before we do that, what do you say we head on over to Stride and play us a game of Tin Pin? Because there's something good we can get here. So let's see if I don't completely bone this up. Who decided that should be a thing? Hey, I did it. Oh fuck, come on. Oh fuck, I forgot. Some of them got the big fingers so you can save yourself and- Oh, but he defeated himself. Uh, rad. God. No, no, I don't want to. Leave me alone, Jesus. And he saved himself. Wonderful. In case you notice, viewers, I'm, uh, I'm not too good at Tin Pin. Oh, no! But as you see... No! Oh! God damn, he saw that one coming a mile fucking away. Hey! I'm pulling this back! No! He pulled his back! Oops, not what I meant to do. Oh my god, I did it! <laughs> Clutch! Only two seconds left. Ooh. My heart hurts a little bit. I got very excited there. But hey, I beat Shooter legit! Oh. Anyway, we get 10-pin wheel, which is such a good pin. There's a better variety we get later on, but for now, this one is gonna be great. Should be all the way near the bottom, yeah? So let's drop, uh... Let's drop that. So the way this works is when we drag Neku around, instead of just doing his invincible thing, he does this cool tackle. We get a much stronger variety later that's pretty much the secret to beating the final boss, but we'll worry about it later. Two o'clock, huh? Ooh. I mean, how do you just, le like, lose a mic? You just leave it up, right? Oh, 
Well, you just strip the wings and sell it. Mics are a lot of money. Oh. You look a little sketchy there, my man. Anyway, so I guess we're helping these guys for the day. Ah, damn it. Anyway, we get some defense boost for Joshua and 10, oh, uh oh, oh, 30,000 and five yen. <laughs> Did we all chip in for that one? Anyway, let's see, uh... Let's get some info. Well, I mean, they're the Reapers, after all. Yeah, <laughs> BJ. Maybe he just wants to practice in secret, but only with that mic. Well, uh, you want to give us some info on that, maybe? Kadoi City, huh? Well, that should be enough. Why don't we go uh, do some leg work ourselves? It's time to be right Okuzanoha. Cool. Let's head on over to Spain Hill. Aha! Looks like we're on the right path. I mean, it's kind of hard to tell them apart, Joshua. They all just look like red hoodie guys to me. Unless it's been the same red hoodie guy the entire time. Anyway, let's get some uh, questions out of it. Out of him, rather. Aw. I like it. So why not let just BJ get it out of his system and see if he hates it? Hmm. Looking a little shady, Tenho. Alright, well, we got all the info we can out of him, so uh, what do you say we uh, start looking for more? But I will be right back at the moment.
All right, and I'm back. So, over to Molko. Aha. Think we can get some info from there. Yeah, how could I forget you guys? You're the reasons we're not dead. Oh, they're just bored. What is he get a fun nickname? Well, that's not really short, but... How is everyone else finding out about players getting wiped out? I mean, I'm down for some more pals here. I'm just stuck with fucking Josh. Joshua, what is your goddamn problem? Yeah, it sucks, actually. Huh? Aww. See, I need these guys in my life again. Can I be- can we have, like, a partnership of three? It's so goddamn cute. Oh, hey, that's the, uh, that's the big one from the slam-off. Nice. I like them a lot. Cool. Real gold, huh? Scratch empty space to activate. I don't think I ever got that one to work. So I never really tried. Anyway, so let's check out this public telephone. You didn't think they would just leave it here, did you? Or if they did, someone else could have stolen it? Uh, my first phone didn't have a camera. <laughs> didn't have one till 2012. Don't get what you're getting at here, J-Dog. Oh, hey. That's fucking nifty. How the hell did Hanakoma make something like that? That's pretty damn cool. Thank God for this incredibly niche ability. Aha! Huh? Oh, what a convenient limit. I mean, we're still looking into the past, Neku. Aww. Well, that's all we can do there. <laughs> anyway, there's a green noise here, so let's see if I don't fuck this one up. This pig is apparently invisible. I also haven't found it yet, so... Where am I looking? Right. 
invisible in the bottom screen. So let's give this a shot. Aha! Well, fuck that up. Uh, oh well. It gives up here uh, a pin called the first gear. I don't know what it does, but I'm sure it was something cool. Let me actually look that up real quick to make sure I didn't miss out on something really fantastic. Pin 307. Ah, oh, yeah, teleport. Instead of just dashing to an area, you can instantaneously teleport there. So it's a little faster, a little safer. Now, I'm sure there's something cool about it, but, uh... I know not. Mm. Oh, hey. Our good pals. Um. Yeah, it's us. We're here to blow your big promotion opportunity. You gonna do sick noise on us? Hi. I want to talk with him. His candy looks delicious. Yeah, I, I do wonder what he's eating. A lot of Japanese treats look delicious. Like I finally had mochi uh, a couple months back. It was like a green tea mochi. Because my local uh, convenience store, or rather, my local grocery store, when I lived uh, when I lived in the apartment, uh, had green tea mochi available at the supermarket, and I tried it, and uh, I was not a fan. I do not like the texture. <laughs> yeah, what's up the hell with... The, uh, well, I screwed that up. Can you do it now? God damn it. Anyway, that's the whole reason we came here. Nothing else. Because from now, we're going to have to head to the Scramble Crossing. And it just gives me more opportunities to talk about how, uh... Life events occurred with the Japanese treats I've tried, and I actually think that's the extent of it. Mm, yeah, that's really it. Besides the obvious stuff like sushi and whatnot, but... Everyone's tried sushi, and if you haven't, you should. It's good. Or, I like it, rather. Uh, let's see how much money I'm, uh... Because I can dump a lot of these spare pins and get, uh... Get some real good shit in me. Like, here, we can get 42,000 yen right off the bat. Uh, let's be a little more careful here and only sell five. Because our... We're about 6,000 yen short of hitting the limit for what this wallet can do. We are going to extend this, this episode, but for now, I don't want to waste money. So, let's get some cordyceps in us. Ooh, Viper drink. Had a man side, huh? Does he sell this already, or...? Yeah, red Viper is different than Viper drink. He's fucking out of man's height, though, and a lot of it. Much obliged. I might be wrong, but I think there are better ways to try and attack, but if not, uh, again, it's more post-game stuff. So what do you say we slurp on this, uh, this delicious mushroom? I wish there were more than just two, uh... It's edible. I just wish there was more than two, uh... Rows. Uh, a little difficult to see. Hmm. hmm. That sounded suspicious, so let's give it a good old look see loo, why don't we? Yeah, that sounds legit. Of course, I don't particularly understand, because big crowds just kind of make me a little nervous, but... Uh, let's talk about the mic.
Well, maybe you stole it. But what's your alibi? Hmm. I might have bought the Dogenzaka thing, but... Gotcha, bitch. Yeah, but did you steal the mic? He can follow through on that. He's a reaper. Man, bullying reapers did not really seem like a good idea, but... Why bother advertising it if you can't find it anywhere? Then again, Nintendo Entertainment System Classic, Super Nintendo Classic. Yeah, we mentioned that before. Ooh. I keep hearing about this composer guy. Do you have any insight on him? <laughs> so we can. We're like spooky ghosts. That's what he just said. So yeah, just get him in the real ground before you can, uh... Before they can get you in the UG. You think it's a way to bridge the gap? Uh ho! Well, we'll sit and chew on that for a second, but uh, we're not going to get our answers now, so let's just focus on what we can do. It is kind of fun to control the uh, movement with the uh, A, B, X, and Y buttons. Just feels so wrong. Though, uh, Kid Icarus Uprising did it too, if I'm not mistaken. Ooh. <laughs> Maybe if we bluff it, they'll end up, uh, shooting themselves in the foot. Ace Attorney! Don't make me choose. Uh, th th this one. Sure was, Bucko. Well, Joshua, if you want to be a dick, maybe I'm going to jerk you around. You ever think about that? Uh, that came out significantly worse than I meant for it to. But Josh, we swore we wouldn't tell! Gosh. Hey, 
<laughs> oh. That's not cool. <laughs> Beach. Huh. Yeah, yeah. Now 155 for real this time. Da 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 da! Tenho, was it you? It must be scary to kind of lose your phone in a phone booth. Or just losing your phone in the city in general, I'd never be able to find it. Of course, the closest city to me is DC, so if I lost something, it would very quickly be, uh, belonging to someone else. Sounds good to me. Mommy, Daddy, please stop fighting. Triple Seven, give him a shot on vocals, though. Ah. So you just left it there for anyone to take, huh? Who do we know that uses a megaphone? You can, re you can record things with a megaphone? Math, my mortal enemy. I mean, you make decent money now. We could just buy another mic, right? Put wings on that, too. <laughs> Quite simple, actually. None of the above. You, my friends, got ganked by... Yeah, we don't need the run through. This isn't Duncan Rampa. Chill out there, my bronze skin baby. Huh? <laughs> Zeta sexy. I don't know why I love the fact that he just carries a megaphone so much. No, oh, poor baby. So I say, it could be in any of these trash piles. But it was right next to us the whole time. It's 
Sounds like a plan. And that was the bulk of the day. Uh, they got their mic back? Can we interact with them at all? Nope. It's time to just move on. We haven't been to the Shibu Q heads. Oh, fuck. Or however you're supposed to put the emphasis on Shibu Q heads, maybe? I don't know. Alright, here we go. It's gonna be the same as last time. You don't have to beat him, you just have to survive. But we can see how well we can do. That'll be fun. How did I whiff that? Oh, he blocks those. Wow. Oh, he was guarding. Never mind. Uh, he's kind of kicking our ass, huh? Yeah, the only issue with uh, the tin pin one here is uh, it's a little... It runs out kind of quick. That'll be fixed when we get higher varieties. But anyway, we get more attack boost for Joshua. Live slow and die fast. We have like a thousand of those. And the day is Scarletite. Alright, then just kill us. Whatever. Do you not actually want to kill us, my man? He's clearly not, because he keeps letting us live. What have we here? Oh, hey. Why do you say we keep that for the future? Who knows, it might save our bacon. Anyway, Super Q Heads is the one I've been wanting to come for for a while. Hello. In fact, this trendy wallet is one of the big things. Now we can hold like 10 times as much yen. So, bam. And all it costs us is uh, a bunch of rare metal. I can buy this and it's kind of cheap. Thank you. And then otherwise, it's just kind of a variety store. Hello. Like a big mega store. Uh, not gonna blow Scarlet's head on that. I'm always down for more CDs. Thank you. And what else do we have here? Anything more for Josh? Uh, more defense, but also got Scarletite, so not gonna bother. Cool. Thank you. And finally, Nishimura drugs. We can finally see the hot therapist or uh, pharmacist that. That one guy was talking about really early on in the game. Anyway, bravery is uh, brave plus is what I believe is considered to be the most uh, efficient bravery training in the game. Kind of pricey. Doesn't give you a much immediate uh, bravery as the uh, cordyceps does, but you can eat a lot more in one day, so it's pretty cool. Uh, sink bar. Don't even care. HP tablets, not a bad way to get HP. And defense medicine, not a bad way to get defense. So, if you're looking to max out your stats, Shippy Q Heads is the way to go. What does anyone here have to say? Twins. You just have to breathe really hard and you will float. Ha! <laughs> what friends? <laughs> Until Shiki. Did that just say dead in the background? That's not, uh, it's not at all subtle. Well, it's hard to say because the speech bubbles are in the way now, but... Well, just gave that away. <laughs> I think that was the point. Get, 
It's clear the answer. Just fuck everyone else. Just have fun. It's, uh... What is it? Hedonism? I said we're just agreeing with Josh to get him to do what we want, huh? Diabolical. T title drop? Aw, we really are learning. To give us hope, maybe? <laughs> A goal that we can aim for. And this is one of my favorite stores in the game solely because it's hey, in man. such an out of the way place. It's like, does anyone uh, actually come here? Well, thanks for that. Here's a scary looking man. Oh, fuck, is that show? Boy just draws and thinks about math, huh? Huh. Maybe it's a metaphorical river. Hey, beat us to it, huh? We're doing our own thing, Jesus. So we're about to just flood Shibuya with taboo noise, huh? That's a frightening thought. Um. <clears throat> cool. Anyway, we have another shop in Wild Boar, so let's take a look at what he's selling. Skull duck? A deck, rather. Prevents immobility. Uh, that does sound pretty good. What do you do, skull deck? Oh, don't actually care. Uh, let's buy that one, just because that does sound like a pretty good pin that I think we're gonna need in the future. So, uh... Let's jump a couple 5Ks. And by a couple 5Ks, I mean let's get to almost our previous max. Hey, man. Don't have to wrap it up. I'm gonna wear it out. Actually, can I equip it right now? Uh, what do I have uh, already on? Yeah, I got this on. And it doesn't appear J-Dog's with us. Okay, let's worry about that later. Feels like a good time to read his mind, huh? Yeah, but why would he imagine that? Huh? 
Hmm. All right, let's get a little more context. Ready to end of the day strong? 